I am absolutely buzzed today. I've just got outside. I got up actually really early. I got up at 6 a.m. because today I'm gonna go do some work and I'm well excited about it because I should be helping my brother and sister's dad build a cabin or at least the base for a cabin out in the forest so i am really keen as, as you can imagine this is just exactly what i want to do and me do it in it doing it in the cold english nature i'm i'm you know i don't know exactly how it's going to go um but basically i'm really excited about it so i got up at six o'clock this morning thinking that we were going to go nice and early you know i'm an early bird um and i'm a fast mover typically so i like to get things going and like to get things moving so i was up at six bathed my feet in vinegar because I get really bad feet in the winter here. I get chillblains and it's horrible. So I, I did that. I made some food, a nice peanut butter bagel, had a coffee, mm, 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 and I was basically ready to go. I have so many layers on because apparently it is freezing where we're going. So, um, but anyway, I'm ready to go and I'm basically just waiting for him. It's now 10 o'clock. So I got up way earlier than I needed to, but, um, but oh well. Look how nice these little plants look, by the way. I think it's just a, a weed, but why so pretty, eh? So anyway, I'm, I'm taking you guys along. I'm taking you for the day. We're going to vlog this. Hopefully, I get some cool footage and hopefully I learn some new skills. So um, come with me to get out into the English forest and start working with wood to build a cabin. This is going to be sick. learned to use one of these in Thailand by a Thai guy and it was huge it was bigger than this one like gigantic and it's kind of lucky that he taught me because there's a particular way of doing it and it's like maybe I'm not necessarily doing it 100% right every time but you keep a nice straight arm and it's wicked like So, so far this has been really fun. Um, we're about to start screwing stuff. I'm really, as I always do when I'm in the nature doing stuff, really conscious of like body mechanics, being a PT. Oh, that, that camera looks dirty. Let me give it a wipe. Being a PT, I met many people from many uh, jobs, uh, whatever you want to call it. And basically everybody gets a bit fucked up from their job, whether it's a desk job or whether it's like manual labor. A lot of guys who worked in construction and stuff had pretty dodgy shoulders and dodgy backs. And I think it's like really important to just um, make sure you're moving right. Already, you know, it takes a little while to get used to using a tool to warm your body up, but I'm gonna be really conscious to just keep opening my hips and sort of squeezing my glutes and that. So I'm just moving around now while I wait. I just learned how to build a base. It's a base? Yeah, it's building a frame. frame building a, base. a frame for a base so I can make my own house now. And I'm loving this because obviously, as you guys know, my goal is to get back to nature. And one day, I would like to build my own house. 
and then I don't need much even if I've built my own cabin that would be sick to live in you know like I've lived in Thailand in cabins and now I'm literally learning how to do it so so anyway I'm gonna get these log things take them up and honestly this is so much fun like I feel like I'm supposed to be here I'm learning a skill like that I will use in the future hopefully I can't get it straight though. I can see why the army have their kit the way they do. Look at that. I'm trying to. 